Oh, this one should be good. Top 5 Neat Google Hacks and Tricks Presented by Macboy Productions The first trick I want to show you with Google is using the tilde or tilde key, whatever you want to call it. It's located in the corner of your keyboard. Yeah, that one. When you enter that and then a word, you will receive results for that word and its synonyms. And if instead I just type in Apple, you can see that only the word Apple is bolded in the search results. But if I typed in tilde or tilde Apple, hit enter, and you can see things like Mac, QuickTime, Computer, and Windows are bolded on the search results as well. Number two, using Google to quickly find the weather in a city. To do that, just type in weather, followed by a postal code, which I will not show you because I don't want you coming over to my house and doing stuff. Not me. Hit enter and the results will automatically show up including pictures. How cool is that? Now this one I'm sure all of you have heard of using Google as a calculator. So for example, if I type in 4 times 4, I will get the result of 16 automatically. Now you don't have to be specific in what you type in at all. You can type in 4 divided by 3 and it will still give you the correct answer. And here's something that comes in very handy when you're flying to check a flight status. Instead of going to the airline's website, looking for your flight number, flight status, and wasting your time there, just type in your airline and flight number and it will automatically come up in Google's results. For example, if I type in Delta Flight 5778 and hit enter, it'll give me results and the status of the airlines of flights 5778. And last but not least, something that can come in handy in some of the most important situations is Google's currency converter. If I want to find out what $5 in Canadian currency would equal in American dollars, I just have to type in Canadian dollar to US dollar and do the calculations from there. Now, as you can see, I didn't type in US, I wrote US, and it still gave me the accurate results. And as a bonus, I will show you how to hack into security cameras around the world through Google. Yes, only through Google. Just type in this text that you can copy and paste from the description or the sidebar or the bottom bar below this video. Hit enter and you have a bunch of links to click to. Now you can just go to the first link and check it out there. This link is a airport somewhere around the world and it's going to show you what's happening in live time. Pretty cool. Check it out and tell me what you think in the comments below. So there you have it guys, five nifty tricks that you can use with Google on a day-to-day -day basis. Thanks a lot for watching. Please don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe on these videos and channel. And guys, I will see every single one of you next time right here on Macboy Productions.